Welcome, spacefarers, to the latest must-have mods for Starfield showcase. Get ready to enhance your Starfield experience with these incredible additions. And don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button. Let's dive right in. First, let's introduce the Voluptuous Body for Beauties, also known as VBB. This mod transforms the female character's physique into a much more voluminous proportion. When using this mod, female characters appear to have larger and more shapely chests, hips, and waists. For those who have enjoyed Bethesda games with applied body mods, this is undoubtedly a much needed addition. While outfits tailored specifically for this body type may not have been released yet, the emergence of this basic female body shape holds significant meaning. Have you found body mods quite intriguing? If so, this interface mod is bound to captivate you even more. Star UI HUD grants you complete control over most HUD widgets, offering updated loot lists through DPS and VW, along with enhanced item cards. You can resize, reposition, recolor, or disable most HUD widgets. Thanks to these features, various interfaces, including looting, have been further upgraded, allowing you to grasp a wider range of information at a glance. Isn't that truly amazing? How about refining your first-person animations? This can be achieved with the Firearm Tweaks mod. Firearm Tweaks introduces three main mods. Firstly, in the case of Tactical Sprint, it displays an animation where the weapon is raised upwards while sprinting. This can be selectively applied based on weapon type, particularly complementing handguns, providing a very appealing motion. Additionally, when using the alternative M1911 Reload, the reload animation of weapons like the old Earth pistol is replaced with that of the M1911. The improved AK Reload animation mod enhances the reloading animation of the AK rifle, transforming the combat experience in Starfield making it more diverse and lifelike. In this session, let's refine your captain's hairstyle a bit more. Of course, this is through the new hairstyles with Tutorial. This mod adds new hairstyles that you can use in Starfield. The default hairstyles may not truly showcase your uniqueness. Now, with these hairstyles, you can differentiate your captain's look. There are various hair options available, but unfortunately, you can only choose one, so choose carefully. Simply select the second hair slot in the character customization mode. Next up is the Starfield HD Reworked project. This mod maintains the original art style while reworking textures, particles, faces, and more in high resolution, adding finer details and beauty to the game. It covers various environments beyond just the city. For instance, rocks, walls, floors, and terrains are reworked in high resolution. It's even said to make changes to the entire crowd and beyond. Give your Starfield visions an upgrade with this mod. In this time, let me introduce three recently added mods from the Compact UI series. First, we have the Compact Crafting UI, a mod that modifies the crafting menu. This mod allows you to see more craftable items at once, increasing the number of items in the crafting menu by 120%. Additionally, it optionally supports a dark mode. Next up is the Compact Build menu UI, a mod that makes the outpost construction menu smaller, allowing you to see more items at once. This increases the visible items by 45%. Lastly, we have the Compact Crew Menu UI. This mod modifies the crew menu, increasing the number of visible items by 50%. All of these mods share a common feature, which is resizing the menus to increase the number of items you can see. If you like these changes, give the Compact UI a try to 
customize your interface. Next, we have a mod designed for your convenience. It's called Zero Weight, an SFSE plugin that constantly sets the player and ship's current weight to zero. This allows you to loot as much as you want and carry everything without any constraints. While it may be considered a cheat-like plugin, it enables you to play without worrying about item weights. If you've been struggling with weight-related issues, give it a try. Next up, I'd like to introduce Stellar Glass Mod. This mod provides realistic textures on glass surfaces, adding more realism to the environment with flat normal maps and reduced surface noise. It's considered one of the best mods to eliminate ripple patterns, chunks, and dirty glass textures. Through this mod, you can achieve a more sophisticated level of glass. Enjoy a visual upgrade one step further. Next, let me introduce the High Viz Crosshair and Scope Replacement Ultra Wide Compatible Mod. This mod allows you to make the edges of scopes partially or completely transparent. Additionally, it enhances visibility by changing the crosshair color to red. Personally, I believe this modification of scope textures is an excellent approach. Having transparent or semi-transparent edges is also a commendable feature. What are your thoughts? If you like the scope textures shown in the video, I recommend giving this mod a try. Next up is the Crowd NPCI Ambient Occlusion Fix. There has been a common complaint about the eerie appearance of Crowd NPC's eyes in Starfield. This mod updates the ambient occlusion map for the eyes of Crowd NPCs to put an end to this eerie gaze. Some have even mentioned how the gaze of the crowd can be so unsettling, sending shivers down one's spine. If you've ever felt like the crowd's intense stares are directed at you, this mod might just provide the solution you're looking for. Lastly, we have Power of Three's Tweaks, SFSE. This mod addresses game engine bugs and provides various tweaks. Each option can be enabled or disabled through INI settings. For instance, it allows you to pick up items without triggering alarms, pay fines to avoid going to jail, and stay in your current location. Additionally, it offers many useful features like not picking up books you've already read unless they're quest items or skill books. In the case of Skyrim, Power of Three's tweaks was considered an essential mod. It will be interesting to see how vital it becomes for Starfield in the future. Thank you for joining us in this exploration of essential mods for Starfield. The process of creating these videos can be quite demanding, but your subscriptions and support mean a lot to me. Until next time, happy gaming.